I know this this is more than you signed up for. Like son, your kid's gone missing. Yeah. Right. I'd help you out even if I want my job. The longer this goes on, the worse it's gonna get. The more of them is gonna be in serious trouble. Look, running up a fifty thousand dollar debt. Gambling, that is though. a cause for concern. But right. Look, at least Morgan's not doing hard drugs or living on the street. He hasn't been pulled into something that you can't get him out of. Not that we know of. <sighs> I, keep, I keep waiting for Carly to bring up my father. But she hasn't yet, but I know she's been thinking about him. I'm not sure where you're heading with this. My dad, he, he was a gambler. An addict. Mm -hmm. Growing up, if he was, you know, winning, he'd be around. If he wasn't, he'd be gone. Sooner or later, he was gone for good. I lost contact with him for years, and then he drifted back into my life, and we tried to reconnect. Sometimes we would, until the next bad luck came. I can't tell you how many bookies I had to pay off over the years. You're afraid Morgan's heading the same way? No, no. Morgan's gonna have a better life and I'm gonna make sure he gets it. For a long time, I despised my, my father. To me, he was weak. Because mm. he, he chose a deck of cards over his family. It took me a while to realize that it's the addiction that's in charge. Mm. Not the person. Mike never beat it. My son's gonna be different. Wait up. Like, I doubt Morgan's a gambling addict in the making. You know, he's, he's just a college kid. You know? Got carried away, and before he knew it, he was in over his head. It's hard that, you know, you, you, you to barely know your son. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Carly sent him off to that military school, and I, I barely got to know him. I got on before you felt, you know, Carly did it to punish you. No, you know, I understand that now. I mean, I just think of all the, the, the hell that Mike was been through. I mean, the kid was, what, 17? Mm -hmm. When he killed Claudia, and he was 18 when he went to Pentonville. Carly couldn't risk that happening to Morgan, so she sent him someplace safe, right? Mm -hmm to protect them. The thing is, we couldn't protect them because we protected them too much, you know? So now, Morgan doesn't know who he is. The simplest way to get to me is through my children. Michael understands that, Christina does finally, and Dante, he's, he's a grown man, he's a cop. So, you know, I, I still want to protect him. But he's gonna make his own decision. Morgan's different. He's a kid. He doesn't know what to look out for. He doesn't know what to guard against. You read the transcript. Right? Like the chest between Morgan and his all life girlfriend. Yeah. Jerome around the world. Did you did you see how much she encouraged him to keep playing? Mm -hmm. And then when when you know he would lose, she would have him bet more. You think she's hustling? Somebody's hustling my. Somebody's hustling my son. Out of all those you know fancy college kids, my son's the only one with a fifty thousand dollar. Debt. And then she invites him over, you know, to, to hide out, to break off all contact with his family. Well, we don't know if Jerome around the world is the reason Morgan is not returning calls. We don't, we don't even know if she's really a girl, if this is some kind of setup, some kind of ambush. Well, that's a good thing you've got backup, isn't it? I don't know who they're messing with. I'm gonna do whatever it takes to find my son. I'm gonna bring him home. Escape.